What's up, my peoples? MGO here, the freaking geek himself, and welcome to another exciting episode of MGO Build Stuff, the series where I teach you that one man's trash is another man's treasure, but one man's treasure is another man's hernia. It's just painful. But moving on, we are continuing with the Eagle Moss Ghostbusters Ecto-1 kit. We're still on issue number four. We're on the second, the second uh, assembly of issue number four. So... There is the magazine. Here are the parts. Let's get down to it. Cause ain't nothing to it, but what? But to do it. Let's slice this bad boy open. Slice. That didn't slice. Slice. That knife needs a new blade. I always say that and I keep not doing it. That knife needs a new blade. But anyway, let's get out the parts. We have everything we need. Everything we need. Screws, good stuff, things and stuff, stuff and things already. So, ooh, lots of screws. All right, here we have, yeah, lots of little, lots of little bits and pieces here. Ooh, 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 this is gonna be intricate. This is gonna be an intricate one. It seems like, can I even get the bubble open? No, I can't even do that. I'm not even capable of that. Oh, there's so many little parts that are gonna go flying everywhere, aren't they? Oh, I don't want this to happen. Oh, don't happen, please. Oh, easy. Easy, 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 easy. Oh, we did it, we did it, we did it, woo! Okay, we'll put our screws over here. Let's get our instrucciones open, where are we? We are here, okay. Alrighty. So let's go, let's go. So we are building, what are we building? This is where my tongue stops working already, so soon. We're building the right engine block, which is the right side of the engine block, I would assume. Cool, cool. All right, so what are we doing here? So we are doing this and we are, oh, we're bringing in uh, this piece from last week's build. So what are we doing? We're doing that and that is going in there like so. And then we turn that around and that gets some screws. What does that get? Where they are, where they are, where are they? A P screws, yeah. Whoa. A P screws. Alrighty. So we need, we just need three A P screws. One, two, and three. There we go. So we'll just kind of get them started here. That's always the proper course of action. I get them started and then tighten them. So that way you still have some wiggle room to make any adjustments should you need. There we go. We got them started, and now, we screw! We screw. All right, so now we can tighten these boys up here. Alrighty. Woo! You know what's funny? This is the one thing I look forward to the most in the week now. <laughs> I really do. I look forward to doing this. Um, and actually, uh, a very uh, good piece of news is that uh, once I'm fish? Once I, I can't talk today. It's Monday. It's Monday. It's, it's I'm recording this on Monday. You're watch. I'm gonna upload this on Wednesday. So you're watching this on Wednesday, but I'm recording this on Monday. So you know, the weekend. The weekend always takes its toll on me. But uh, <laughs> I have I have to get my brain used to doing this again after the weekend. But uh, a good piece of news is that. Um, we won't have to take a break, I think, after we're done with issue four, because I already got the shipping notice for the next uh, batch of parts. So hopefully there won't be a break in between issue four and issue five. So that's great. That makes me happy. So we can just keep right on rolling. And I like that. I like it. Okay, so what are we doing here? So this, oh, it's this piece, which goes, why does this goes? It goes right there, like that. Like that, okay, and then gets sandwiched onto the piece with the Cadillac. And, okay. Alrighty, and that goes like that. And what does this get? This gets some, here we go, BP screws, yeah. 
BP screws. I got some BP screws here. Whoa. You know what's funny? Somebody was like, that melody sounds so familiar. It is. It is from something. I don't know what it is either. I've completely forgotten. I spilled out all the screws. I don't need all these. Oh, man. Yeah, that, that is a melody. I got that melody from something and I don't even remember what it is. I just, I just, it's stuck in my brain and I just apply it to everything when I sing stupid songs like that. Baby screws, yeah. I don't know where that came from either. I, I know it came from something. I got it from somewhere. Don't remember what. So yeah, I'm with you, dude, whoever said that. Yeah, I know that that melody did come from somewhere. I don't know, man. I don't know. Um... So here's a fun fact for you. Uh, the second letter of the screw names is the material that they are going into. Um, I already knew that, but everybody loves to tell me that anyway. <laughs> it's really kind of common sense if you think about it for about a quarter of a second. You know, it's really not hard to figure out. It is pretty common sense. Um, you know, again, I know you guys like to think that I'm stupid. I'm really not. I'm not. I have my moments. Don't get me wrong. I totally, you know, like we all do. We all have our moments of just total idiocy. But, you know, I'm really not stupid. I just, yes, I, I, I know that the second letter is what material is going into. These are APs. That means they're going into plastic. Yes. And the ones that say M are going into metal. Yes. I know these things. I know. Like I said, it's common. It's, it's, it's not a hard code to crack. If you think about it for about an eighth of a second, you know, it's not a hard code to crack. But hey, it's all right. People are just trying to be helpful, but at the same time, they're talking down to me. <laughs> they're talking down to me like I'm an idiot. I'm not an idiot. I'm a smart man with a big brain. Sometimes it doesn't work, but you know what? It works, you know, 99% of the time, it works 50% of the time. Okay? All right, so anyway. What are we doing now? Okay, so now we're bringing in this section from last week's build, and we are now going to be putting these pieces together. Which way are we doing this? Like this, and like this. I've already built this part before, so you think I would already know how to do this. Oh no, I had this wrong. There we go. That goes like that, and that is sitting there like so. There we go, like that. Ah, there we go. Okay. You sit, no, you're, no, oh, fine then, fine then, be that way, be that way. What does this get? This gets a piss cruise, yeah. Uh -huh. I wish I could remember what that melody's from. I wish, I wish. If anybody does know, <laughs> probably nobody knows because, you know, people love to, uh, people in the comment sections love to go, I know things, I know things that I want to tell you. So I'm actually genuinely surprised that nobody said, I know what that melody is from. Why are you using that melody? The funny thing is when people say that I'm referencing things that I don't even realize I'm referencing, I get that you have no idea how often I get that. They're like, oh my God, I'm gonna reference this thing. And I'm like, I've never even heard of that thing you're talking about. So that's that was just an accident if I reference that. <laughs> You'd be surprised how many times I apparently accidentally reference things. Um, it happens quite often. But the funny thing is that the obvious references that I make, nobody catches on to. That's that's the funny thing. <laughs> when I make really obvious references, nobody nobody catches on, nobody says a word about it. But references that I make by accident and not even realizing I'm doing it, everybody's like, I caught on to that! And I'm like, oh, that's, that's news to me. Cool, all right. <laughs> Again, you'd be surprised how often that happens. All right, so... We have this piece here, so now we're actually going to bring in the rest of the engine. Boom! And now this is going to go on to this. We're going to secure all this together. Oh, this is exciting! Oh, this is exciting! Okay. Let's see. Okay, work with me. Work with me. Oops. I, I knocked out the... Uh, you know what? Since this is going to be a little pain in the butt. Okay, okay, well, I can't take it out. <laughs> it's kind of stuck there. All right, so we're going to try to get all this into place here. Okay, this is fighting me. Why are you fighting me? All I want to do is love you. Oh, there we go. Boom! There we go, baby! Ooh, that's beautiful. That's a beautiful thing that's happening there. What does this get? This gets some 
Where are they? DM screws, yeah. Oh, uh -huh. DM screws. And I also enjoy just singing the name of screws. And the reason there's an M there is because they go into metal. Hey. <laughs> Alrighty. Just this engine alone has just got a hefty too. This thing has some weight to it. There's there's already a good bit of uh, a good bit of diecast in here. Okay, that's going that's going deep in there. That's going deep in there. We're going deep into this engine. Ooh, baby. Oh, this is lovely. This is lovely. I am happy. If you can only see the smile on my face right now, I am excited. This is wonderful. I love it when a plan comes together. Or an engine in this case. But you know what? I'm still happy about this. I'm happy. There we go. Look at that. Look at that. Look at it. Look at it. <laughs> That's a thing of beauty right there. It's coming together. It's coming together. <laughs> Okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> Just making my weird noises of glee here, but uh, all right, what are we doing now? We are now assembling the fuel pump and filter. Okay, cool. Fuel pump and filter. What are these pieces? What are these pieces that I'm looking at? I don't know what I'm looking at. I think it's this? No? What am I looking at? What am I looking at? When does this happen in the movie? Oh, no, it's not this. I think it's this. Okay, it's this piece. Okay. This piece, and it gets, where is that weird looking piece? This? Is that what it is? Oh, no, 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 it's this piece, okay. This piece, all right. Just didn't know what I was looking at here, okay. Okay, so this goes like that. Okay, okay, so that's nice, there's a little peg there holding in place, oh, that's nice, that's beautiful, okay. So that gets an AP screw, yeah! Whoa! Alrighty. Give me one. No, I just need one. Just one. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Boop. Alrighty. Okay. So that goes there. Boom, 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 boom. Alright. It's a very small piece here. But it's going to go somewhere. It's for something. It's for something. It's a fuel pump. Fuel pump and filter. It filters and pumps the fuel. It's, you know, it's, that's just kind of common sense. It just seems like, yeah, that's exactly what a fuel pump and filter would do. It would pump fuel and... Okay, now what am I looking at? I'm looking at this. Okay, so that goes on to this. Like that. Is there a specific orientation? I don't think so. That looks like... No. Okay, this piece, the thinner one, looks like it should go facing the back. Right? 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 Oh, there's a, oh, okay, there's actually a little tab right there. So, okay, so there's only one way to put it in. Okay, cool, cool. All right. All right, so that means that goes in there like that. Yes, okay. So that does that. And then all of this goes connected to what? What's happening here? That goes, oh, this is like that. Seems like what's happening here, okay. And then that gets an FP screw. FP screw, yeah. Whoa. FP screws. Do you FP screws, yeah. Whoa. What? That's just, no, that's. That's what's happening. What's happening now? What's happening? Who are you? Who am I? Where's my soup? I don't know. Okay, how's this going again? Because I totally lost my orientation now. Um, this is going like this, I believe. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, with the thicker. Okay. I think I had it the wrong way before. Okay. I think we're on the right track here. That's going to be a little bit of a thing to get going. There we go. Okay. There we go. All right. We're there. We're there. We're there, man. Okay. I think I have this right. 
this is one case where I'm not totally sure if I have this right. But you know what? We're gonna go with it. It looks like it. It looks like the picture. It looks like the picture. So you know what? We're just gonna go with it. We're gonna work with it. If not, if it's wrong, then we'll know it's wrong and we can just switch things up. But it seems like I got it right. Okay. All right, we got that going. Okay. That's a thing. That's a thing that's happening. Okay. So now we are bringing the engine back and this is going where? This is going on top of this. And again, there's a little tab there. So it seems like there's only one way for this, 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 this to go on. This, which is like that. Okay. So that's going to sit on there, like that, and then this is going to get, uh, what this piece looks like, yes, and then this, again, has a little tab there, so there's only one way for it to go in, there we go, and this, and then all this gets secured with a what, a BP screw, yeah, whoa, Okay, we just need one. Boop. I don't need two, I need one. Just one, thank you. Thank you, boop. Thank you. Oh, this is lovely, this is lovely. We're doing some like intricate work here. This is, we're doing some intricacies here. Intric intricacies. I can say words, I swear. I know, I know words most of the time. 95% of the time, I know words 40% of the time. There we go. Okay, that seems, that seems correct, I believe. That looks about right. Okay, so now we are moving on to what? What are we doing here? Uh, more small pieces. Oh, Lord, lots of small pieces. Okay, so what do we have here? We have this bit. What is this? This is the ignition coil. It is a thing that coils the ignition, apparently. I don't know. I don't know. Ignitions need coiling, apparently. I guess. That's a thing that needs to happen. I don't know. What does this get? What is this? Oh, it gets this piece, looks like. Okay. And then gets... I can get these pieces out. There we go. So this is, what? Eh? No, it's gonna be the right piece. What am I looking at? What am I looking at? Oh, you know what? Okay, no, I don't think it's this piece. I think it's this. Yeah. Does it have a, is it somewhere? Okay, it doesn't tell you anything. This tells you nothing. Wait a second, I just have to look. Uh, where am I? Okay. Because it does give you, like, the, the names of parts here, so that's why I'm like... Okay. 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 Sorry, just... I need to make sure I know what I'm doing here. But I believe it's these bits that I'm putting on here. I think. I think. Do not quote me on that. <laughs> I'm not entirely sure. But we're going to run with it. Okay. So. It looks like. We're doing. Okay. This is some intricate work we're doing here now. Ooh, so we don't need this piece yet. I don't believe. We're just doing these two parts. So this. It's like a little cap that goes on here. Right? Right? Am I not right? There we go, okay. That one goes on there, and this goes in here. Ah, uh, there we go. Like that. One thing I notice here is I do actually, <laughs> this set actually comes with a, a pair of tweezers, which I'm guessing is for these like smaller parts here, but it's okay, these are just nice little sharp Little pointed tweezers. These are good tweezers. I have a pair of tweezers like this that I use for uh, applying stickers on some of my figures, but I don't know. It's okay. 
I think I can manage with just my bare fingers here, but if I need it, hey, it's there. I will not look a gift tweezer in the mouth. Is that a thing? Is that a thing you can even do? I don't know. All right, so this goes on like this. So again, lovely. There's a little peg for it to help you situate it properly. That's not going to stay in though, but just for the sake of orientation. There we go. It goes on there like that. Can you even see what I'm doing? Probably not. It gets a big pair screw, yeah! Waha! I know you heard that. I know you know about that. You know about them BP screws. You know all about them BP screws, yeah. Waha. Alright. So, ooh. So, ooh. So, eh. So, ah. Okay. This is also the video where I make random noises. You should be used to that by now. Alrighty. So, there we have an ignition coil. Okay. The ignition can now be coiled. Wonderful. Wonderful. That's glorious. That's a glorious coiling of ignitions right there. Okay, cool. Cool. What are we doing now? I don't know. I don't know what we're doing. Now we are inserting spark and distributor cap plugs. All right. The sparks and plugs need to be distributed. Okay, so we're using, I believe, these. Yes, yes. Where are these? No, it's a totally different shape. Okay. Okay, we're here. All right, cool. I know where we are now. Uh -huh. So are we just doing all these? I think we're just doing all of these. Yes. Seems like it. So we're just going to take these out. And... Okay, so these are going into... Okay, there's just little ports on the sides here. So these just plug right in. Because they're spark plugs. They plug in. <laughs> these are little... Here's a little bit of parts. Okay. Ooh. Can you see what I'm doing? There we go. Sorry. Sorry about that. Again, sometimes I make the mistake of paying more attention to my hands in the viewfinder. I try to be good about that, but you know, it happens every now and then. There we go. They just pop right in. Oh. It's kind of, they just kind of thoop in. There we go, we got that side, and now we'll do the other side. And, ooh, yee -gee. Oh yeah, oh yeah. There we go. This is lovely. This is a lovely thing. Oh, this is just the engine. <laughs> That's the funniest thing about this. We've done so much work so far on this kit and we're not even done with the engine yet that's that's insane all right so we got that going okay cool so now what are we doing uh now we are grabbing what this looks like this piece yes this piece and that is going here doesn't matter which way nope doesn't matter which way that just gets plugged right onto this That's nice and snug. Oh, that's snug like a bug in a rug. Look at that. Boom. Okay, cool. And now we have, what's this? Another another dipstick? It has two dipsticks? Oh, I wish I had two dipsticks. Oh, man, the multitasking I could do. Anyway. <clears throat> that's not, that's inappropriate. That just goes right there. There we go. Yay. All right. <laughs> oh, this is coming together nicely. Oh, I like it. I like it. All right, so what are we doing now? Um, so where are we? So now, okay, we're still back here with this bit, and now we are just plugging in. Now we're plugging in all of these, these things. I don't know what they are, they're things. Distributor caps or spark plugs? No, are these the spark plugs or are these the spark plugs? No, I think these are the spark plugs. I don't know. Again, I don't know car parts. I don't know car things. I just don't. I just don't. I just don't, but whatever. Whatever! It doesn't matter to me. I genuinely don't care. <laughs> Again, this is all 
This is all knowledge that will go in one ear and right out the other the second I turn this camera off. So it's like, I know people are going to try to, uh, I know people want to, want to, you know, educate me and, and, you know, learn me some stuff, but it's really, it's pointless. Don't waste your time. I'm just, I'm not going to remember any of it. Not a single bit of it. I'm not going to remember a single solitary bit of it. It's just going to go in one ear and out the other because really it's, it's kind of, um, for me, it's kind of useless knowledge, and I already have enough of that in my head, as it is, so, you know. You know, because again, I don't drive, I don't have a car, so it's like, why do I need to know the names of the parts of this of an engine? I, I don't, I don't need to know it. It serves me no practical purpose. <laughs> so, that's just kind of the way my brain works. If I don't actually need this knowledge for my everyday life, then it just, I just don't retain it. I don't retain it. That's just the way my brain works. Like 90% of the stuff I learned in school, already forgot. I forgot. I don't remember any of it. Geometry, algebra, all that stuff. Just don't remember a dang bit of it. Why? Because I don't have to use it in my everyday life. So why am I going to retain that information? You know what the answer is? I'm not. I didn't. I don't remember any of it. If you put a, an algebra problem in front of me right now and said, hey, solve this, I'd be like, I wouldn't know. I wouldn't know what's happening. Oh, these are, I'm guessing this is what you uh, would use the uh, the tweezers for, for these, little, for these little baby parts. They're so little. But it's okay. I got small hands. I got small fingers. So you know what? It's okay. It's okay for me. I'm, I'm making do. I think the tweezers would actually make it harder to do this because tweezers don't really have that much, uh, you know. These tweezers don't seem like they have any kind of real grip to them. And the tweezers I use for my stickers don't have any real grip to them, so I don't think they would really be helpful in this situation. Let me try and hold on to a little, little plastic part. Okay, and then it gets just one right in the middle. Okay, this one goes... A specific way this one goes facing this way I think they're all supposed to go a specific way but again I don't care <laughs> this in. okay all right so we got those in none of that there's no there's no symmetry whatsoever to this let me try to let me try to at least get things looking somewhat elegant here there we go that looks a little bit better okay all right, so we got that. And now, what are we doing? Now we are, oh, okay, I saw this part here. What's this? It's like a little, where is it? Oh, here we go. This it? Yeah, it's like this little, this little blue, this little blue hose here, a little blue, like, rubber hose. And, okay. Oh, is this, what, is this what we need the tweezers for? Maybe it is, I don't know. So basically, we're gonna feed this. This is gonna go from this to that. Hmm, this is going to be, uh, oh, actually very easy, okay. <laughs> I was ready for this to be just an utter chore, and no, that just went right on. Okay, cool. And, oh, there we go. Boom, went right on. All right, cool, there we go. That wasn't such a chore after all. <laughs> okay, do that, try to make it look a little bit more, try to make it look elegant here in some way. All right. Cool. Look at that. Look at that. Okay. All righty. We're doing things. We're doing things and we're doing them mildly well. All righty. So now what are we doing? We got this bit. We're almost there. How long have we been doing this? We're going on 29 minutes. Woo. This is going to be a long one, but there's a, there was a, there's a lot to do here. There's a lot to do in this particular assembly. So, hey, I don't care. I'm having fun here. I'm enjoying myself. I'm enjoying the build. And we have a BAM screw, yeah. They're stuck together. They're, they're stuck together. Why are they stuck together? Hey. <laughs> there were conjoined twin screws there. That was weird. That was that was a very odd thing. Odd situation right there. Okay, so this goes right. Yeah. Boom. Boom. And that gets affixed with a screw. Okay. Ooh, doggy. 
I don't know what this is. I didn't read the name of it. What is this? The starter motor. The starter motor, apparently. And I don't think I'm in the right spot here. Nope, I'm not. There we go. Ah, we hit pay dirt. There we go. There we go. Now we've reached the promised land. Okay. That was my bad. I've seen that thing's in the right spot. That's all me. That's all on me. That's all right. It's all right. Just a little faux pas on my part. A little faux pas on my paw. There we go. Get that snug like. Oh, there we go. Okay. So we got that. And now this is getting what? What specifically? What is this piece? Oh, this piece right here. Okay. So that is that. This gets this. Doesn't seem like this is any specific orientation. That just goes right in there, like that. And then this gets affixed with an AP screw, yeah! Okay, just one. Boop, there we go. Boop, magnetic screw. If I mention I love magnetic screwdrivers, I love them so much. They are my pride and joy. I like my babies. Alrighty. Boom, boom, boom. Alright. I hope you guys are enjoying this because I am enjoying this immensely. This is fun. This is fun. I love just I, I love just seeing all this come together. This is really cool for me. I don't know about you guys, but this is really cool for me. Alright, so. Okay, now we're on the, uh, this is the last piece, I believe. It's this piece right here. I don't know what this is, but it's, uh, it's part of the starter motor. It's the part that starts the motor. I thought the motor starts the motor. We need something to start the motor also. I don't know. I do, again, I don't know these things. I know nothing about these things. Okay, so that goes on like that. Oh, he has some intricacies here. Okay, so if my... Let me just get out my screw here. BP screws, yeah! Waha! Okay. Boop. All right. This last bit, this last bit right here is going to be the last bit. And that will go on like that. And then we will try to do this. Oh, we're going lefty. We're going lefty. Alrighty. Okay. Just to get it started here. Ooh. There we go. Just had to get it started there. I had to go lefty. <laughs> Alright. And I believe this is the final piece, correct? Correct? I believe so. All right? Just make sure. Yep, and that's going on to the next set. But yeah, we're done. We're done here. Woo! That is it. I'll hold on to these tweezers, though. Hey, I'll keep that. But that's it for that. Toss that to the side. We don't need that no more. And look at our engine. Look at how our engine is coming together. That's a beautiful thing. That is a beautiful thing right there that we are putting together. Look at that. Look at it. Look at it. That's nice. That's a nice thing right there. Look at all that. Oh, wonderful. Wonderful. Love it. Loving it. Loving it. Alrighty. So there you go. We are done. And we will continue next week with the next assembly. I hope you enjoyed this exciting episode of MGO Build Stuff. And as always, if you would like to sign up for your own Ecto-1 kit, you can click the link in the description down below and check that out. As always, things, links, description below. You know how it works. So, there you go. So remember, you don't stop playing because you grow old. You grow old because you stop playing. Be geek. Be proud. Boom in your face.